A warning tonight about the popular food delivery service Daily Harvest after hundreds of people become seriously ill. Some of the victims say they have suffered serious liver and gallbladder problems after eating the company's French lentil and leek crumbles meal. Others went, even had to undergo emergency surgeries to have damaged organs removed. Sandra Mitchell joins us live from the KTLA News Center with the latest on this disturbing details. Sandra. Yeah, we're talking about 500 seriously ill people across the United States. I spoke to the attorney representing some of those patients. He says a woman who was seven months pregnant lost her child after eating this product. And the scary thing, no one, not the doctors, the FDA, they don't know exactly what in the product is made, making people so sick. Scared me scared my husband. A few weeks ago, Sarah Schott wondered if she would live through the night. She went to the hospital with severe stomach and body pain. Well, having to like pack up and go to the ER and just say, here are my labs. It sounds like we need to make sure that I'm, I'm going to be okay tonight. Schott's illness could be linked to what she ate, a product from Deli Harvest, a popular vegan food company. Almost 500 people across the U.S. already reported they became extremely ill after eating French lentil and leek crumbles from the food delivery service. The company now has recalled the product. I know enough about outbreaks to be really concerned. The FDA is investigating and the first lawsuits have been filed, but so far there is no explanation for the mystery illness. Tests coming back negative for hepatitis, E. coli, and salmonella. Daily Harvest posted on their website that despite consulting with numerous experts, cooperating with FDA's investigation, working with our supply chain, and conducting extensive testing, we have not yet identified a cause. Another patient, 32 year old Caroline Sweet of Hollywood told me by telephone just hours after she ate the product, she too became really sick. I was gagging. I was like nauseous and really sick to my stomach. The FDA now is testing for a wide range of toxins, but right now there is no real explanation and no prognosis for those who are still suffering. Not knowing what caused all of this damage is scary because you can't know yet if there's long-term damage. And the woman in our story, Sarah Schott, is a food safety advocate. She says this is a, just part of a larger issue, the need for more government oversight when it comes to what we're eating. She tells me there are only two FDA food investigators for the entire state of California.